Hi, it's Matt Gaz from UK Lock Sport. I'm just doing a follow on on my homebrew picks. As you can see, I've got one here. This is my attempt at like a space bow guitar. I'm not very good at making homebrews, but this does work. I have had it in a lock with no security pins in it. It's the lock you've seen in the past couple of videos of Sterling. I always like to test my picks on a lock with no security pins just to make sure it can actually open a lock because otherwise you can be there for ages raking a lock with security pins. But what I'm going to talk about today is making handle. I've got some copper wire here and this is basically the way I like to make a pick handle. So basically I'm using these pliers here. These are from my fiance's hairdressing set believe it or not. And these are used to crimp extensions in into hair when they heat the glue up they stick it onto the hair. So you can pick these up on eBay. Um, I like to start off with getting a piece of wire like this and just getting the end and folding it in two. So you've got a hook. I then crimp the hook in. So it's kind of hard trying to do this through a camera. So I crimp the hook like that. I then get my pick handle, the base. I insert it so it's sitting in the middle. Like that. I then get these because these are nice and delicate pliers and I hold down with pressure. Doesn't always work first time, you have to be a bit patient because as you can appreciate they're both thin items and they can get very fiddly. So there we are, we slide that back into there. He says What's happened is it's crimped the wire down too much now. I'm trying to do this and keep it in camera is quite tricky. So we're back. It's on there. Get your pliers and hold it down like that. So what I can do is swapping hands without it going anywhere. And you just get your wire and you wrap round. Try and keep your wire as tight as you can. And then you just wrap this round. Basically what this does is it gives you something better to hold on to. And it also strengthens the pick handle. Now you see there's spaces in here. I don't like this in mine. Some people do like it. So what I do is I just get this pliers there and do it to the loose so they can slide up and down the shaft and then I just put it on and just push it down. Now I don't need to use the pliers because it's on a bit of weight, it's solid and I'll just twist the pick instead. I've had a bit more practice at this so as you can probably tell, so you can just wrap it on. I'm trying to do this as quick as possible before I run out of uh, memory on the tablet. So basically you just put it back on again when you get this gap and you just push it down. As you can see by this bit here, it's just closed the gap up. I left it a bit too late to close the gap at the bottom here, but hey -oh. you can undo it all, but it tends to make the copper wire more fragile. This is just a copper wire that's out of an um, earthing cable. I stripped it. And as you can see here, I've just stripped it out. 